Hello, all you lovely people of YouTube. Um, as you've probably seen, this is Rip R4. You might be saying, well, Rip, what is this? If you read the title, you already know where you're at. You're at Rip's Talk Show, episode 21. I am here joined by Ziggy. That, that, I'm that. thinking. And Huck. Stop. With, oh, that's what I was doing. When you're... If you're a visual listener, you'll be watching us play MCC in the background. The games in MCC will be changing because right now, as we're playing, we'll be MOA hunting. Isn't that fun? Isn't that nice? But, you know, that's a little fine. That's fun and dandy even. But what I wanted to quickly jump into... Wait, I can't talk about it because you didn't watch it yet, but we didn't give you time to watch it. Do you care for actually. spoilers for a trailer? I mean, well, I mean, I don't really feel like trailers count because they don't tell you anything. Well, I'll tell you what this trailer tells you. Crosshair being redeemed for the Bad Batch Season 3. Well, I feel like we all knew that was coming. Yeah, but like, yeah, I got he's bigger. wearing his old armor. Which looks so good, as always. And not only I that... Um, I'm pretty sure Tech is there as a mind, uh, uh, brainwashed clone assassin. Kind of like what we saw in season two. You know? The clone assassin. Just, just a hypothesis. Although, you want to say, if, if you, you know, watch the trailer, my brain, brain right now feels like mush right now. Wolf was in the trailer. Rex was in the trailer, but he didn't have a pauldron. Um, you got, you got new clone, clone styles. Asajj Ventress was in the trailer. I want to point something out about that. I actually didn't get to say it when I saw it. Um, well, I, that was the only thing I saw was was Asajj Ventress. Um, I think Dave Filoni recycled some animations from season what would be season six point five because that clip with Asajj Ventress is the one of the animations from the deleted scenes. I mean, ah, bingo, found it. Who wants the first punch of the night? I want it. It's my video. Oh, man. Oh, man. That's for missing. <laughs> Fair yeah. enough. I would do the fancy grenade skip, but uh, I'm going to hunt down these goddamn birds. Yeah. So, yeah, no. There's a, there was a lot of things in that trailer that was it was wild. Like we saw clones. There was a clone that was almost fully lean. <laughs> you lean. Lean trooper. Um, oh, there was a red one as skull. well. Hold on. Um. And there's not a fucking well back here. Yeah, but there was Gooberson. Um. I will tell, like I said, there was a lot of good stuff in that trailer. But there's something interesting about Wolf. So as you know, Wolf is there in Rebels with uh, Gregor and Rex, right? Hold on, hold on. Don't move forward. Don't move forward. I'm looking yep. for... I am too. I don't know. This, this one can be weird as fuck sometimes. But as you know, Gregor... I mean, like I said, Wolf. But you know what's crazy? In the trailer, he was... He, he had a Commando, two TK Troopers, and two Shinies with him. As if he's not defected yet. Isn't that strange? I wonder if that means we'll see his chip forcibly removed. That's the commanding officer of the of the Wolfpack Battalion. He still has uses for the Empire. So they're not gonna give him up that easily. The plows bros. They're they're just not going to let him transfer, you know? Yeah. All right, there was one in there. I can't. Uh, I think I might know where if one those of two shinies, be. If those two shinies were wolf pack, I'm going to feel so... Uh, it's going to be, like, so sad because, like, wow, the wolf pack didn't even get to keep their grays. Because you would think they would get to Cody keep the gray. On the other hand. Yeah, Cody went from orange to gray. Only, only, and he got to keep his stuff. I got to say as well. 
Oh, shit. I mean, what are you going to say to him? He ran, like, four divisions of the army. Like, there's not... You can't really tell him no. I mean... Like... Yeah, he, he painted his armor color gray. It's like, alright, well, take this off. He's like, I'm not doing that. <laughs> the wolf stays on. The wolf stays on. <laughs> I think all wolf took out of his color, like, I, I don't know yet, because we didn't really get a good look at him. I, I think wolf took out his yellow and red on his armor, because, you know, he had, like, a tiny bit of yellow and red. On his helmet. Alright. I didn't see anything over here and I just sucked up all the... Well, not all of it, but most of the ammo from the RPG. Also, cuddle up is one of the challenges if you want to get some melee kills in now. Alrighty. I gotta say... <laughs> the Minecraft cast is kind of strange... Because I forget a lot of the people who are at it, but the two that really catch my eye is Jason Momoa and Jack Black. Wait. Wait, is it Minecraft? Yeah, Jason Momoa is going to be in the Minecraft movie. Yeah, that's right, it is getting a movie. I'd watch it 100%. Wait, who, 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 do you know who he's going to be playing as? Well, uh, originally they said Jason Momoa is Steve, but now Jack Black is Steve. Uh -huh. Is there going to be two Steves? Unless one's Harold Ryan. Oh, Jason Momoa. Is Jason Harold Momoa Ryan. is definitely going to be Harold Ryan. That's what I'm thinking. Watch out, clearing the hole. And, uh, well. Alright, there's no Moa back here. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, God, I just got beamed. There was a carbine, uh, flood. Damn. Oh, no way, no bro. fucking way. Nah, fuck this. Fuck this. We're going to a different mission. <laughs> um, that is bull. Fuck that. I should have just grenade skipped. There, you can force a, um, a checkpoint if you do so that. I was going to say, by the way, Gears. As you know, the Gears Collection was getting like updates here and there. Like Every other month there would be something like, Guys, Gears Collection may be happening. Right? But now it just seems like there's stuff coming out almost every day about it. Which, well, I yeah, mean, it's gonna, it, it will be happening. It's in fucking yeah. testing. Yeah. It's in testing, bro. And all I'm saying is, guys, you know my content. You know I've been replaying the Gears of War games. You're going to see me do it again when it comes out. Even though I know what happens. You know, spoiler for a game from 2008. Yeah, I know Ben dies. Yeah, I know Dom kills his own wife. Yeah, I know all that happens. I'm still going to play it anyway. I'm still going to act shocked. Not because I'm trying to fake a reaction, but sometimes I'm dumb and I'm like, oh, wow, can't believe that's happening. Already knows what's happening. <laughs> I don't even do it for and the YouTube. Like that. That's just me as a person. <laughs> I'm like, wow, I can't believe that you're... happened. Plus, you're going to see Gears of War 2 updated. Oh. Yeah, honestly, I hope I can actually get the fucking achievements. <laughs> I'm going to, like, 100% the, the achievements for Gears, the mass, or Gears of War, the Marcus Phoenix collection. The motherfucker collection. I'm actually pretty close. Like, I'm actually getting closer with the um, Halo achievements. Um, because I'm at, like, I think 539 out of 700. I'm, I'm for Master Chief, I have at least 502 achievements out of 700. So, yeah, I'm pretty... What's mainly left is, all the, is a, a few multiplayer ones. Uh, Easter egg ones and like lassos, and also like Halo Two skulls and Halo One skulls. But like I can do uh, all of that pretty quick because you can use Acrophobia to get skulls. 
I'm still missing a few far sc- par scores and par times, but I literally, oh, fuck me. literally, I ODST. I can tell you with confidence, ODST. I've completely finished. I have no achievement left to get an ODST because I I finished. I did ODST last though, and I finished up the few remaining uh, achievements I needed in la- ODST. So. Oh my god! Fucking kill me! What the hell? Oh wait, that's not even what oh. killed me. It was the oh, sorry, headshot. There you go. Where the fuck did my... Oh, sh... You gotta be kidding me. Why... The ODSCs just straight up ignored that grunt. Okay, I've had enough of this. There was a glitch semi-recently where you... There was a glitch to board the anti-air race. So that's why I didn't try boarding it. I I thought you guys wanted to do that too, so that's why I didn't. What do you you mean, board the race? You can board it. Like, you can go inside it. No, no, it. no, no. That's not even new. That's not what I'm saying. Board as in you jump on it and start beating it or plant a grenade. But... Oh, hold on. We gotta look for that fucking mo real quick. Like, that's what I mean. There's a glitch with that. Um... You're supposed to get on and beat it. What do you mean? Yeah, but there's a glitch that... It just didn't work. Oh, well, I know nothing about that. I know it just because I've experienced it. it. Because I'll go to ho- like hop on and board it to you know destroy it. I'm like, huh? I found a random ass grenade up here. Oh yeah. So, you know, it's funny. People are talking about like the Destiny season. I've he- I'm hearing like mixed reactions. People are like, oh yeah, it's great. Oh, it's fantastic. Oh, it's horrible. Dog water. I'm sitting here like, yeah, I can't wait to play that with Ziggy. That's going to be fantastic we'll for content. I, I told you by Chinese New Year's when we'll be playing Oh, it. yeah, no, no, no. What I'm saying, though, is, like, I can't wait to hear why people are either saying it's fantastic or it's dog water. But my, my question is... I am not seeing a single goddamn Moa back here. We, we still have a few things to do before we, like, start playing the season. Like, we need to do one more run of Warlords. Oh, yeah, Fourth fuck. Stream. And then we gotta play it again so I can get more clips. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, a four, like a fifth time. <laughs> but, no, um, no, I do want to talk about some play. Destiny news. There's a reason I actually brought up Destiny besides, you know, talking about the season. Um... The reason I brought up Destiny was because of the f- changes that they're going to be making before Final Shape releases. You mean none of the changes we asked for? Um, I asked for them! Oh, that changed. No, I'm mostly talking about the fact that they're like, We're gonna remove legendary shards because it's too hard to grind for new people! Uh, which is which just is not blaming... We're gonna get hit by that. Which, <laughs> by the way, I would like to mention, the legendary shards thing, not true. Um, like just objectively wrong. Yeah, you know, it's oh, but holy fucking shit! This gun is not. Di- You've got to be kidding me, Hawk wipe. Hawk. Okay, just just wipe, just wipe. This is pissing me off. Wipe. Kill yourself. How is he still alive? In-game. There we go. In game, in game, in game. Alright, I'm putting this bitch in reverse. Actually, in game though, because we're. Uh, if you. Uh, audio listeners, I know this is really confusing for you, but once again, we are playing MCC. We're currently on the Covenant, and we are dealing with Banshees. So, there, yeah. now it's not a problem. But back to what uh, I was saying earlier. Um, the reason I brought up Destiny was because before Final Shape, they're adding the feature. Before Witch but- Queen, even. <laughs> Well, I've wanted it before Witch Queen, but the f- the feature that's being added before Final Shape releases is being able to re-customize your Guardian's faces. I now, wonder if they're going to hold up their end of the deal and make it so you can add customizations, because they said they wanted to add customizations. Apparently, there's already rumors of that, um, speculating that it, that's the case. But what I wanted to say is their their thing was like so either you made your guardian to reflect yourself back then and you just you're that's just not who you are anymore, or you made your guardian to look really edgy, 
or you made it as a joke, but you kept with it. Either way, there's probably they a reason... They had to say the edgy. Yeah, they did. Man. Either way, there's <laughs> probably a reason that you kept your helmet on, but now, with this new update, that probably won't be the case. The only thing you I can't change is your, like, species of origin, whether that be Awoken, Exo, or Human. Um, and I just gotta say... I'm really excited for that because once that comes out, I'm moving everything from my second warlock to my main warlock, making my first warlock look like my second warlock, deleting my second warlock, and making a titan either as an Exo or as the Coltrane from Gears of War. I thought we agreed on Coltrane. Coltrane, baby. It would be funny. I'm my my human and my warlock human is. And I'll take be this motherfucker. All right, I'll I'll drive. Get smooth. Like I said, I have a. That thing I, didn't fucking die. Hold on, I can change that. Okay, there's just a free ass wraith down there. All right. My human's ugly as fuck. I made my human, like my my main warlock. I made my main warlock when I was in middle school. I didn't think this through. Oh, I'm going to get jumped. I graduated on. high school oh, like th three years ago almost. In May, we'll mark three years. Pull this track. <sighs> Wasted my two plasma. Yeah, I love it. But what, was, but what I'm saying is. That feature, like, should have been, should have been beat, in the game. Fucker. Oh my god, the like, grunts got me. It should have been in by launch, right? But I'm glad it's being added before final shape. You know. Oh no! I just. They had, I mean, they had yay! We can finally shit. customize shit. But like, come on, Bunchy. It. You said you would add that. I don't know how many years ago. I just have no hope for that company. I'm going to play Final Shape, and I hope to God that game just winds down. I mean, I wonder what the episodes are going to be like. The Fanatic was on the cover of one of them, so that's got to um, be interesting. Well, we got to wait for this bubble shield to fucking pop. Or not. Hold on, there should be Moas up here. Um... The fuck was I gonna say? <laughs> well, in good game related news, Pal World's doing fucking phenomenal. I don't know. I don't know what to say about Pal World because there's a bit of plagiarism going on. Because they have it's actually. It's not fucking plagiarism. I'm not talking about the merging of Pokemon stuff, even though that's a little shady. I'm talking about the plagiarism of stealing people's designs. I don't know. I still gotta look into that because God knows how true that actually is. I mean, I don't oh! know. There's a brute there. It's blatantly just like basically just Pokemon designs, but not of like Pokemon that actually exists. I feel like as long as he credits whoever made it, I feel like that's a little different. Well, if he did, then I don't think there would be as many of issues, but he's not. Yeah. Hold on, so I checked there, it's not there. I swear to god, if this is one of those like, oh we put one MOA in permission, I'm gonna be fucking pissed. They probably did. Because I don't feel like searching goddamn data hive. Gay hives. You really don't want to do Cortana? No, oh I was gonna that was gonna be the next pit stop if I couldn't find any. Um, no, but Power World's like, I think my game just crashed. Oh, no, I'm good. Power World's having a lot of good success. I don't fucking care about the, if he credits people that just, it'll make everyone's lives easier. But, um, yeah, that shit's being developed by a single guy. So, I mean, can you blame him for maybe trying to use some shit? The only thing I can really fault him for is not saying anything about it. Yeah, I'm. I'm excited to play Pal World. I well, don't if you credited, you know, I wouldn't have a problem. But like, 
the thing is, like, I get maybe, like, using it, right? But, like, if, without even saying oh, anything, like, if, without oh, no. acknowledging, it, it, I don't know, it, it rubs me the wrong way. It does not give me good vibes. I'm all about crediting people and what they do. Because without credit, like, how, how are we going to sustain work? Well, I doubt any of the people that, I'm not bashing them, but I doubt any of the people that made those fan art fucking Pokemon oh, actually get paid for it. No, no, obviously not. But I'm saying is, like, if it's their art, then, like, it's kind of, like, it's just, like, it is just straight up plagiarism for, you know, putting it in your thing without crediting the person who made it. Because it's not your creation. And I get it's a fan art of Pokemon, this whole thing is basically Hold just on, Pokemon gonna... with guns. No, wait, That's... I'm trying to assassinate him. There we go. And another... There, you can have his invincibility. Another issue with Power World, by the way, fun fact, is um, you'll find this interesting. There, uh, There's a mod modder who's probably going to get sued soon. What, the Pikachu thing? No, the, no, it's not just Pikachu. It's every Pokemon and replaces the playable oh. character with Ash. They already removed the mod link. The fans were scared that uh, the dev would get sued over it, so they took it down. Uh, <sighs> I do not miss it. Oh, man. I don't know. I I'm found out today. All my friends at work are going crazy over it. A buddy of mine already put in like 80 hours. Jesus Christ. That, were, uh, were, that was just within like <laughs> the first couple of days. He like played it nonstop when it came out. I will say, um, in di other gaming oh, news, fuck. you I don't know if anyone's noticed this, but since like 2014 with the current rendition of the Game Awards, my... Uh, Microsoft, aka you know the um, what do you call them? Uh, console exclusives, you know, stuff like Gears or Halo or just like anything Microsoft exclusive hasn't oh, yeah, basically hasn't been nominated for Game Awards ever. What the fuck? In the past, in the current rendition of the Game Awards, isn't that strange? That is a bit strange. So then again, I was really concentrating on trying to get on this fucking mongoose. Oh, what I said was, in the current rendition of the Game Awards, since like 2014, no Microsoft console exclusive has been nominated for Game, game of the Year. Whack. And, and it's just like so strange to hear, it's like, wow, no Microsoft uh, thing has been nominated. And like, I don't know. I like it's funny because I, here we are recording this podcast, and I'm I, and the only reason I found this out was because of a podcast I listened to this morning, and uh, you know I'm gonna credit that podcast. Yeah, being, I wish people just saw that kick, kick ass fucking trick I just did. The the episode, it was a uh, it was morning somewhere. Um, what's today? It's the 23rd. It was January 23rd, 2024's episode from Morning Somewhere. You know the. Bernie, Bernie Burns podcast. Um, and for you, Ziggy, that's the guy who voiced Church and RVB. Hey, the Marines from the beach are still here. Nice. There might be a MOA in that tower, if I'm not mistaken. I, I do have to say, I want to welcome our guest who just joined um, our call. Owen, how you doing? Oh my god, Owen. <laughs> What's that, an Owen boy? Uh, okay. Heavy metal's a challenge, so destroy all the banshees you can. Yeah, that's why I was killing those uh, pure forms earlier. Ah. I don't even know if these rockets are going to reach. They're not. 
Plenty of brutes down here, by the way. Going for a bombing run. Let me see if I can't splatter him. Got one! <laughs> you gotta love it. They're using tactics we've never seen before! What are those tactics? <laughs> Hold on, Rip. Don't go too far. I gotta go to this tower. Okay. I was playing uh, Firefight uh, last night with um, Hawk, and Owen, and Speedy. And no, it was it was before Speedy, but it was Denmark, and we were playing on a Val, uh, Valhalla. Make sure these guys that's a don't leave map. without me. Because that's a firefight map on Infinite, and I remember I we, got we were just in killing everything. Um, like it was absolutely insane. Because in Halo sure Infinite, there wasn't one in there. Let's just move on. Because uh, because they brought back a feature from Halo Three into Infinite, where you have infinite chain gun ammo. You know, it doesn't re like it doesn't overheat. Is what I mean. Like it, there is no heating system. It's just infinite. Like you can hold down on the trigger forever. Yep. And so I was using that to my advantage, and I ended that game with I think. 8,000 score? Jesus. Which is absolutely insane, by the way. Oh, this Marine will not get back on my Hornet for some reason. Hold on, goddamn. Let me see if I can respawn you over here. But, I mean, I don't know. Here, get on. Oh. oh no. Alright, Hawk, hop on. Sorry, Marine. You're staying it's here. Okay. The other guy won't get on, so. It's all you guys. He's got company. Yeah. But is the comp fine. company lethal? I owe. I want to mention this because we didn't talk about this yet. But the Steam Awards. Overwhelming success. The Steam Awards Game of the Year was not Lethal Company somehow. It what, was Baldur's was it? Gate 3. I, that one yeah. actually makes sense. That game is, yeah. I mean, I haven't played it, but like that game also has overwhelmingly positive reviews. Oh, yeah. I, I will still <laughs> find it funny that, that Lethal Company is outselling Call of Duty. Um, oh, yeah, that... that... It pretty much went, like, head-to-head -head with COD in, like, every fucking uh, category, and it just won. Yeah. I'm not seeing this thing. It's pissing me off. I was trying to blow my cock right now. What? Me. Hi, Cider. Oh, I mean, Hi, Cider. Sorry, I'm gay. Hi, Cider. Welcome to another episode of the Ripstock Show. <laughs> That's really funny. That's how you make an intro. That's how I make an intro. <laughs> Hey, this time you're on an episode with Hawk. You guys can talk about Jeeps again. I miss my. Oh, and, uh, sorry, I was talking about doing coke off of uh, uh, uh off of a hey, chicken. Hey, hey, shush. Off of a chicken? Yeah, you know. Awesome. I'm talking about you know what in the Ohio bullshit. I've got, I've got my Mexican Coca. I don't know why you're trying to shush me. You know, I do, Dude, I I do indeed like Coca-Cola. I've never had Mexican Coca-Cola, though. It's like a billion times better. It is. I can tell like, you that. It is like, also, I straight up just lie to you. I, I don't bro. actually particularly care for Coca-Cola. I don't hate it. I just don't care for it. Nah, have a Mexican Coke. That shit will change your life. I'll try to. You guys are playing campaign. That's that's so lame. We're looking for Moas, you beta male cuck. Yeah, yeah we get, we get, Man, I'm yeah, looking for kills. Loser. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. What are you implying? Yeah, bro. <sighs> it means I'm gonna drive my car into a homeless shelter. They still make those? 
Uh, Maybe. yeah? I watch longer. Decided so I would turn on my high beams in front of your house. <laughs> that is like the worst thing. break this level shield. I'm going to do some trolling. <sighs> Never mind. It broke itself. Somebody Catch. bring his fault. Um, I do have to say, Sided, how are you doing on, uh, tonight? I'm not gonna lie, I don't feel like shit. Oh, yeah? How, yeah. How, how's your, uh, what was it, your arm? Oh, my arm? Still sucks. It hurts like hell. Yeah, how'd you burn it, by the way? Um, I burned it on a hot pan at work where the, uh, the pans go up to 460 degrees. Oh. I was grabbing it out of the oven, and it touched Holy my arm. Holy shit! It How touched many my drones did I just hit with that? And, uh, yeah, it just left a mark on my arm, and it fucking hurts now. Uh, technically, I hit a lot of drones, too. <laughs> I, I'm sorry, my man. Yeah, it sucks. So, what's it, like, second-degree second burn? I have no idea. It's just a burn to me. Did it, like, blister up? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, just like my uh, just like my last two. Yeah, no, I, I burn myself at work like all the time, but like only only when I started like doing baker shit that it actually started leaving like really bad marks. I'll never forget. It was my first time I cooked in the oven myself. It was in 2016. And I went to go pull uh pizza out of the oven. It was Totino's Pizza out of the oven. Uh, the pizza rolls? No, the actual pizza itself. They make actual pizzas? Yeah, no, I, yeah. I got them for a Gizzle uh, 4 promo. They're kind of good. I'm doubting that. Last time I had anything Totino related, I threw up and I had stomach flu for like two weeks. You gotta make it in there. Uh, uh, I didn't have an air fryer back then. You have to make, it's weird. Totino's, you have to make it in an air fryer. I baked it in the oven. I baked pizza Yeah, they don't the taste good in the oven, I don't know why. What? That's, they never know. You, you have to make it in an air fryer. I'm not even kidding um, you. There's just something about the way it bakes in the air fryer. It's just way better. But as I was saying uh, for this story, it was like... It was Here, 20, guys, I got this. It was 2016, and I... I, um, like the I was I was cooking pizza rolls, as I said. No, not pizza rolls. Totino's <laughs> Pizza. And I, I went to pull out the pan. I was going to go set it on the counter, but I, I was about to drop it, and as an idiot, I went to go try to catch it with my hand oh, that didn't, with with the hand that didn't have an oven mitt on and so rightfully so i burnt my hand oh sure steal all my equipment and steal your equipment i just stole your grenades i mean I'm that's equipment <laughs> oh and search this room come on guys let's gather some mysteries shut up um, what I was going to say, though, like I said, I, I, I got a huge blister on, like, my index finger and my thumb because of that. And I remember, uh, I, I vividly remember this because I don't have this dog anymore. He, he, as soon, as soon as my mom put the pan in, like, the sink started watch, washing, my dog was just sitting there eating the pizza off the floor. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, I don't fucking see it. Let's just go. Like, he wasn't going to town at it. He was just slowly eating he wasn't really old back then because this was like 2016. He was still pretty young. Actually, eh, not really. He, he this was, he was six, I think. But yeah, no, he, he was five. And anyway, um, yeah, no, I, I, I get what you mean. Those, the burn blisters, they hurt like no other. Sighted. Uh, we already talked about this earlier in the episode, but I wa you weren't here, so now I'm going to ask you. Have you seen the Bad Batch trailer? Yeah. So what did you think of, uh, well, first of all, Redeemed Crosshair? Um, I didn't really pay attention to that part, but I you... thought Asajj Mentors coming back was really strange, but not I against about, it. I was about to Should I inform him? <laughs> about what? Oh, yeah. About go ahead. what I said about the scrapped animations. Yeah, go ahead. So the one of the only thing I saw from Bad Batch season three besides the thumbnail up above was was the Asajj Ventress uh clip 
Well, if you can call it a clip, I didn't even watch. I just saw a screenshot on Google. Um, so the pose she's in and the model that they used for her is the same model from the is the same animation and model from the scrapped uh, season six point five. Oh, huh. yeah, that's what they used for her in the deleted scenes. And uh, honestly, I think what Bad Batch is is well, at least. Whatever her involvement is, is just a lot of, like, scrapped animation. So I'm willing to bet she will die. Maybe. Okay. It was It was weird to see her with hair. She had... I can't remember. I, it's been a minute since I've watched Clone Wars. I've watched it, like, seven times. Yeah. Didn't she have hair when she uh, got taken yeah, in by the Jedi? Way. No, yeah, like, she was, like, a... Yeah, she had that weird, like, um... I don't know what you call it, but like half of her, she only had like half of her head had hair. Like it was like that side perm thing. It's called. Because in in season six point five, she had hair, and all of the comics afterwards, she had hair. I think she looks better with hair. God damn, her bald head is scary. I know some people um, who are into it. They don't make fun of alopecia. <laughs> It's not even alopecia. She just shaved her head. All it, they had. Why the fuck is that? that oh, it's Greg's got a Halo armor right now. Oh, I know what we can talk about. I, I'm shocked I didn't even mention okay. this yet. Halo Infinite. It's getting Mark IV as an armor core. Yeah, that was about cool. goddamn time. I'm upset. My question is not just like a kid for something. My question is not a kid; it's a core. My question is why is Mark Six a kit while Mark Four is a core? There is argue. There is Mark Six. Mark Six is. Why is Mark Six a kit? Shoot, um, motherfucker! Why are you staring at him? You have to have the hero rank to have Mark Six. Only twenty. Thank you, Rip. Jesus. I thought, you meant, I thought you meant Mark V, which, yeah, Mark V, too. I get, I kind of get Mark V, but how's Mark IV a strict. core? But, like, like Mark, if Mark IV is a core, then Mark V should be a core, and definitely Mark VI. They should, they should bring, um, Chief's Mark IV armor from, uh, uh, Halo Legends. What? Actually, they should bring all of those armors over. Oh yeah, like Fred, Kelly's. Yeah, uh, well, those ones are mind. those ones are kind of cool too. That would also require three four three to you know give a fuck. I just started. To you, know how, gonna, you know how? You know how? That's we, a very slow fuck to give. You know how we call <laughs> yeah, Bungie I mean, Bungo? Not everybody fucks hard. Not everybody fucks hard. You know, if you fuck this off, I don't think you're really fucking, because that's just limp. That's fucked up to say. Well, we're talking about fucking. Well, don't fuck up. Well, how could you fuck, fuck up fucking the unless you fucking you shoot the turret. You know, if I had AdSense, uh, I would definitely be demonetized for this episode. <laughs> Oh, let me drive by. Let me drive by. Why do all the Spartans in the Halo TV show look so old? Yeah, no. Also, they shouldn't look more than like twenty. The Halo, like Master Chief, looks like he's about like to, he's going through his second marriage and just got done beating his kid. Honestly. <laughs> oh, I can't talk about doing blow. You can talk about beating your kid. I'm joking. Also, I, I talked yeah, about we talked about first. last episode about the uh, Master Chief actor, but dear God, he's just digging a worse he's pit. He's just getting he's just burying burying himself even more. Yeah, no, because he went out and said it, after right, Hawk, fly me onto one of these scares. after literally everyone Roger. united and said you're just wrong. They were like, I'm standing by what I said. That's why I say you know it's bad when the Halo follower has something to say. You know what's bad when you have the entire Halo community agreeing on one that thing. That was some good timing, Hawk. I aim to please. Burn, bitch. 
I thought I, I thought I owned the um I thought I owned Night Soul on DVD. Do I not? What? Weird. Did you fucking shoot this thing down? Yes. Red Dead eBay. Oh, you didn't take out the I thought you shot the back off already. I was like, what the hell? No, you're on it. I'm not doing that. Halo Nightfall DVD. I'm gonna see if I can hit this. Did you get one? Damn. Hey, Hawk. Yeah. The back shot off. You can go up or... you know, Never mind, Ziggy and I are climbing in. <laughs> I'm already on it. Oh my god, Zoe so 101 complete seasons 1 through 3 on DVD. Hey, you got War Chief on there with you, Ziggy. I know, I'm bailing. You know, I actually didn't mind Halo Nightfall. I want to watch it. It's exciting. It's not, it's not like amazing. Why did the Goshawk drive onto like the Scarab? Bro, what? Am I signed in? I gotta say, sighted. I am in sight. If, I am if, alive! Sighted. If I... <laughs> I gotta ask, if I get the 10-year edition of Red vs. Blue, do you want my seasons 1 through 8? Oh, yeah, I would. <laughs> no way! They're fucking alive! They drove onto this thing and it lived! Yeah, you know, like I said... Wait, hold on, Rip, hold on. There's a couple of spots I'm gonna check first. See, uh... I, I'm planning on getting seasons 1 through uh, 10, you know, the box collection. Mm. Um, and if I do, I'll be giving you seasons one through eight. Are any of the hornets still good? No. Um, mine died. That hornet's still up. Wait, I, wait, hang on. Talking of such, oh, that's like forty dollars. No, that's like fifty dollars. Oh. Red versus Blue Chronicles, a complete um season huh. one. Are you big yeah, asshole? Yeah, no. Th look up season one through five. Yeah, Blood Gulch Chronicles, wow. season one through five. Oh, I should have EMP'd him. I got a fucking power drain. I'll tell you how much I spent on each. Blood Gulch, fire. Blood Gulch Chronicles. No, don't shoot him. Don't shoot him. We just EMP him. There's like plenty on. of dead grunts and shit around here. And the recollection collection I spent eight bucks on. What the hell is change? Oh, Mystery Science Theater 3000. Hell yeah. Dude. Oh, I got to get That shit was light. hilarious. Halo Interactive Strategy Game 2008 DVD board game. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you reminded me. So, a tabletop Halo game is being made. Yeah. yeah I'll pop this, is this is the old one, though. It's cool. Yeah, but the Halo tabletop game is more in line of stuff like Star Wars Legion and Warhammer 40k. <laughs> Where the fuck did that thing go? I heard it fly off. It's, up, it's above you. Oh, come here, damn it. I got one shot at this. One opportunity. Yeah! No! Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Do we have any plasma pistols? I know a grunt died here somewhere. A needler. Hello there. I don't know who you are, but welcome to uh, this week's episode of Rip's Talk Show. Darn, I'm going to say something controversial. Yeah, don't do that. <laughs> There'll be some funny lines from, uh, don't, funny... Don't even mention it. Funny RVB. Yeah, don't don't even mention what it. What the f... Oh my god, I think they all despawned. Alright, boys, a new pipeline reveals. We're gonna get an Amazon free pack of the Magnum Guard. The B1 oh, yeah. Power Droid and the BD. I didn't even... I forgot to mention that. So, for those who collect Star Wars uh -huh. action figures, um... Uh -huh. Specifically, vintage collection. Right, fuck it. Be on the lookout for Captain Rex. Wait, isn't there a tunnel over here? Hold on, I want to see if there's anything in the tunnel over here. So I found, I found a, I found a Halo, uh, uh, a Halo listing on eBay. It's the, it's that supposedly it's the, uh, the, Ma the Mega Constructs Halo Hero Series Three uh, Honor Guard, but it's not the Series Three Honor Guard. It's the old articulation one. <laughs> For eight dollars. For eight dollars. Eight dollars. Shit. Anybody want it? I'll send you the link. Sure. Sounds like Ziggy's buying it on a guard tonight. Yeah. I mean, I already have. I, just, um, I have a lot of the white ones, but that's for a very specific reason. I yeah, have the white one. one. It is the white one. 
No, it's a red one, but I have. Oh, like, yeah, no, send me the link there, because I only have, like, one or two of those. I don't remember. I, I got, I got my, I got my white one new in box from the, um, the Spectre. Oh, yeah, I, so I had, an, I have new in box ones, but, like, there's people I buy that. You're gonna, dude, this guy is trolling me right now. Uh, I try, I almost got him earlier. Well, you guys were he keeps over there. flying by me, but yeah, no, there's people like I bulk buy them from. Oh no way, I got him! Nice. <laughs> okay, well, fuck you. <laughs> oh, I could buy the Law and Order Special Victims Unit complete series. Well, let me in. I was gonna go ch check the fins. Well, I'm doing hey, that. No one. You could have picked me up. You're an ass. Okay, I'll do Ow. that right now. Yeah, you're an ass. Some... That's not me. <laughs> In oh, oh you bitch. <laughs> Fine, I'll get my own. Oh, no. oh, it's the old Wolverine. Where the hell did that one come from? Hey, Wait, there's a, there's a banshee out there. Excuse me. Yeah, I know. There is. It's a. Uh... For you oh audio listeners, God. if you're curious on why Ziggy was mad at me, uh, during our Halo 3 gameplay, you know, for the background, because we're recording the gameplay and the audio together, not really a good idea, but I can't do anything else right now. Um, I, uh, I take stole a... the Hornet from him. Hey, Dick, take, uh, check the Siege of Madrigal. Well, I can't when Hawk's doing Can I punch on this thing? Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> That dude's droid call looks fucking amazing. Oh, yeah, no, that, that was crazy. That is full. Oh, that yeah. looks great. I'm not gonna lie. I'm also glad that the phase, the uh, phase one clone trooper that they did again, I guess we're gonna call it like shit. a 2.5. They actually. Rick, you get on top of this right here. The uh, black line for the mouth compared to the like 2020 version where okay, they no. never completed it. God damn it, let's just go. It looked really off. So I'm glad they did that. Unfortunate that they didn't paint the black chin thing and the vents, but that's manageable. Also, Grand Admiral Just take Fong the horn and it will be fine. I can't. For black series. Here's a vehicle, I, Walker. I, I know. I know you can't. Well, it's the, the door is literally too small. Oh, shit! Fuck. Oh, yeah. Oh, you almost killed me. I was so close. You're saying that. Yeah, um, other reveals for Vintage Collection outside of the Captain Rex is what? What another the fuck did Luke you just Skywalker. Say? He's saying other than the Vintage Yodo. Collection for Captain Rex. They're releasing the Vintage Collection for Captain Rex again. For no, I was talking about Cortana. She just said some shit I don't think I've heard before. Oh. They're basing it on the Andor body mode, so that's nice. Um, what Which else? doesn't make sense because it's phase one. What? I said it doesn't make sense that they're basing on the Andor bodies. Andor uh, was the phase two. Why not make the new, like, phase one body? The Captain Rex. Oh, he hasn't oh, gotten no. here yet. Oh, too. Rex. I thought you meant. Yeah, it still doesn't make sense. Rex has his own custom armor. Yeah, but in terms of appearance, for the most part, it literally just looks like plain old armor. There's no real, like, way to identify Phase 1 or Phase 2, other than, like, the lines that you produce. Like, the well- uh, The Marathon logo's on the window back there. Is there a bubble in your throat? <laughs> yeah, kind of. No. I it's thought it was basically... I don't know, because the thing with phase one and phase two, it's more internal design changes. In terms of external, they literally look the same, other than the helmets. I have severe bleeding internally. Nice. Can I Welcome do Welcome to the episode, um, Owen. Other than Rex, which I'm more excited about, we get another Baby Yoda, another X Wing Luke, oh, another I'm Mandalorian. So the uh, Mandalorian oh, just Commander, the covers. Just pick Fleet Commander, Dude, Dude, I don't know, and Axe Wolves. The Sony PS2 Neon Genesis Evangelion. 
Oh, there's also another Mandalorian that's based off his uh, season free design. Axe Wolves is also based off his season free design. And the Mandalorian Fleet Commander is from Season 3 of Mandalorian as well. Yeah. And then there's and another baby Yoda. Sure get behind him. Um, he's I don't know, this wave you know, other than like Rex that. is kind of boring. Really boring. Um, yeah. I don't care about anyone else other than Rex. The Black Series on that brand, we got some good stuff. We got Grand Admiral Fraun, based off his Ahsoka... Periods, periods. A slight update of the Phase One Clone Trooper from a AOTC using the uh, Oppo mold and the Droidica for Blast Series. So we're getting some good stuff, I guess. Indeed. I got one of you guys in box. Oh yeah. Uh so before this uh recording, today Ziggy um got the Traxxas Towers Mega Construct set. Oh nice. Like I'm it arrived it came that, to his but... house today and he showed it to us. Pretty good stuff right there. Yeah, I can't wait for that shit. You gotta love Charge. it. Charge Oh wait, let me check under the staircase. That, uh... Damn, it's still not here. Check every- OH! I also forgot to Check every- Oh, oh, oh my god. Vintage collection figures of... Sabine and- You just oh, got underneath every it. staircase. You oh my god! You gotta love it. You really just gotta Sabine love it. Sabine is based off her season 2 yeah. design and- You really just gotta Chopper. love it. It also apparently comes with the Lulf. Lothal Owl Cat. You already know! Lothal Cat? There's more! You already know! I think they're supposed to be from the the Ghost, but they seem to be based off the uh, figures that were supposed to come with the uh, Hasbro Pulse Ghost, if you, like, sponsor that, you know, sponsor back that. Do they make... So I know they make, like, ships for, like, vintage... Action figure scale, but do they do that for Black Series? Um, no. They only did it once, which was the full. Nah, they did a couple of times. They did some vehicles. Like what? Mostly like smaller ones due to how big Black Series is. Anyways, they did shot the my Tide fucking Rider grenade out of the air with the Force Awakens. Shot. That didn't really sell. They did the Dewback. They did Luke's Land Speeder. They did Ray's Land Speeder. Damn, hearing Dubak just takes me fucking back because I had the original one growing up. And that was it. Dubak. Dubak. What's the Dubak again? Dubak. This guy, uh, Green uh, Lizard. Oh, yeah. Trooper and a New Hope rides into battle. Um, we also Who the fuck took right all my ammo? Wheels. Oh, there's my ammo. There's gonna be okay, never mind, Rip. Rip. My feelings don't matter to you. Four pack. I didn't even listen comes to with you. Ahsoka, season seven, Ahsoka. R that was my fuel rod. You don't. Cheap and R and GG from that one scene in season seven of Clone Wars. Uh, we're gonna get an Ahsoka HK eighty seven. I guess another Dark Trooper. Uh, Ahsoka the White, I think. Yeah, it looks like that. I it's like how I everybody refers to another Mandalorian. Yeah, because we need another Mandalorian, guys. We oh my god, I just found out that we love Din Djarin. The series and the vintage collection lines. He we said, really need another Mandalorian. He said Ahsoka the White, like she's fucking Gandalf. We love Din Djarin. All right. No, it's your point where let me, let me almost every couple jump of on your heads. They're going to make Somebody. another Mandalorian. Oh. oh. Asbro, you don't need to make one every fucking time. Up here. Oh. Just because you have more oh, random oh, oh, Stand you still. You need to make another figure of them. Okay, when I Anyways, jump, you jump. Okay, one, two, three, go. Get season three, Bro Katan with the unique up shoulder armor, up silver shoulder armor thing. You've got to be kidding me. There's no MOA up here. What I've noticed as well. Is there any MOA? It doesn't... I'm starting to question it. I fucking hope to God they're on Cortana. It doesn't look like there's any design changes for the Bad Batch. Yeah. It's basically just 
It's based off that scene from uh, that episode, which is basically just the season seven design. No, what I was going no, 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 no. What I'm saying is, for Bad Batch season three, it doesn't look like they've their designs have changed. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Besides Crosshair, you know, wearing his Republic armor, and Omega having Honestly, longer probably hair. Probably for convenience sake at this point, because I doubt they want to make another CGI model for everyone again. All right, so that's the pipeline I burn, reveals for Vintage it, Collection. I'm not in a hurry. Very, I'm not in a hurry. very Mandalorian heavy, which is kind of boring. <laughs> I did she want me? I guess it's cool being called Dan. That's the only one that's actually kind of cool. Everyone she knows said kind of she kind. knows me. She knows me. Black I Series did. Pipelines. We're getting a Walmart exclusive Mandalorian. I am. IG12. Grogu. I'm supposed to trust your opinion. Leo, if. Who's watching a video? 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 Fuck has that on, please. Cited. Jesus Christ, what is that? Turkey sandwich. Okay. Um. So I guess. Don't be late. Turkey sandwich. This is the slightly less interesting stuff. It's the uh, retro no, collection no, figures, no. which is like the five figures. I do not want a like turkey eight. sandwich. Um. Anyways, we get the retro collection. Am I supposed to understand that in the way that I think I understand that? Revenge of the Sith, Anakin Skywalker, Revenge of the Sith, Mace Windu, AOTSD, Jango Fett, Revenge of the Sith, Grievous, and a Phase 2. I would like to remind I think I guess that's what that this is going to be in okay. the retro collection, so... Alright, I haven't seen a single so goddamn Moa. How about you guys? No. I would like to, uh... Wait, wait, there was a glitch. You could see Johnson just sitting in the background. I never noticed that before. I don't know if that's a PC thing or an MCC oh, yeah. thing. That, that is kind of disappointing. I would like to, uh... Thank everyone for listening to this episode of the podcast. Uh, if you liked what you l- listened to, let me know in the comment section below. Uh, I was joined by all these people. Uh, you'll you can uh, find their links in the description. And with that being said, I'll see you next time. Goodbye, everyone. <laughs>